Hi, I'm Pan. I'm going to show you a few familiar places. First, this is the office. And this is Mrs. Steve, who you can find in the office. Through the main hallway, you'll come down and here's the choir room where some kids will choose choir and some kids will choose band. And then you kind of come in and this is where you will do singing. So to come to gym, you will come up the seventh and eighth grade hallway and then you'll walk through the connector and then the two double doors that you see first is the gym. So the last step on the tour is the band room. So, and it's in the high school, so you'll pass the gym and then you'll continue walking until you get to the arts corner door and you keep walking all the way down and it's the last door. Hi, fourth graders, I'm Ty and I'm gonna show you around the fourth grade, I mean the fifth grade hallway. Okay. And then are most of the, the classes for the, the new uh, fifth graders gonna be in this hallway? Tell us a little bit about that. They will be down at the and over there. And what kind of classes will students have down here? They will have science, they will have math, they will have social studies, they will have ELA. Hi, I'm Theo, and if you ride a car to school, this I'm gonna show you how you get in. Um, you'll be dropped off like right behind me, and then you come in through these doors, which will be unlocked. Um, when you get into the cafeteria, you go to the last table if you want breakfast. If you don't, you can just continue to you can just continue to the study hall. Here's how you get to the study hall. We just came out of the lunch doors and you come down the hallway, take a left. It's um, not the first room, but the second room down here. And if we come in here, um, this is the study hall where you come in and sit down. Hi, I'm Kendall, and this, I'm going to show you where the bus riders get dropped off. Um, as you see, there's a big road. Um, the buses will come in from different places, and they'll line up. You'll walk down the sidewalk, and you'll come in through these doors. Um, what you do next is you just walk up these stairs, and you'll do similar to what the car riders do. You'll go to the cafeteria if you want breakfast, or you'll keep walking straight and then take a turn to the study hall. I just want to say that if you try your hardest, do your best, follow directions, give respect to your teachers, you'll do fine. Be kind and be responsible. Even like, so the bell rings at 40 after, but as long as you get to your classroom by 45, you aren't considered tardy. You want to take notes and do your homework, or you could get in a lot of trouble. If you hear anybody saying that the middle school's a lot harder, um, it seems difficult in the first year, or for like the first few weeks, but once you start to get into it, you get to the routine, and you start to know what you need to do, and then it's not as hard as you think it would seem. There's a lot more responsibility because you have to get to your classes. Because I remember in fourth grade, they just swapped between the one class. You should probably buy lunch at least once because their food here is really good. Being kind and being nice to everyone is extremely important because like you all want to get along because you have to do multiple like projects together and stuff like that.